Mr. Chair, Madam Executive Secretary, Excellencies and Distinguished Delegates, for the past two years, we have had to make tough decisions that inevitably hindered our progress toward our 2030 goals, but we consistently work together to build back better. Thus, this year's theme could not have been more pertinent if it is time to mobilize our collective effort to get us back on track. With this in mind, I would like to share two points. First, progress toward universal health coverage by 2030 must be accelerated. Universal health coverage has been the cornerstone of Brunei Darussalam healthcare system to guarantee the quality of life of our people. Amidst the pandemic, maintaining this policy has been challenging. Swift fiscal reallocation and strategic whole of nation efforts were critical in continuing free access to vaccines and treatment. In strengthening the resilience of our healthcare system, international cooperation is vital. The leverage from bilateral and multilateral ties, particularly in maintaining the supply chain of medical supplies, contributed to the sustainability of our health policy. As such, we value existing collaboration under ESCAP, contributing to universal health coverage and welcome further progress in the relevant action plan. Second, Responsive regional action to the threat of climate change is imperative. Noting that the 2030 Agenda demands a swift and just transition to inclusive, low-carbon and resilient economies, Brunei Darussalam is fully committed to contributing to the objectives of the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change and the goals of the Paris Agreement. In fulfilling our commitment, and implementing strategies under the Brunei Darussalam National Climate Change Policy, regional collaboration is instrumental. ESCAP has generated commendable momentum through its environmental protection efforts, among others. On this note, we believe that by building an effective pathway to reducing greenhouse gas emission, we can keep the 1.5 degrees target alive. Excellencies and distinguished delegates, ESCAP continues to be fundamental, not only in fostering collaboration, but also in guiding the region's progress towards sustainable development. Brunei Darussalam is pleased to be a recipient of such guidance in the form of capacity building and technical assistance, particularly enhancing transparency and monitoring capacity. As we embark on a common agenda, the valuable support from ESCAP will be necessary and fitting with the region's need. For this reason, we look forward to the endorsement of the draft resolution in this session. To conclude, let me take this opportunity to congratulate ESCAP on its momentous 75th anniversary. Thank you.